Hi, this is Mohammed Shakil here and uh, in this tutorial I'll be showing you how you can work with the uh, designing of a soccer ball in G uh, generator shape design workbench in KTW5. So right in front of you you have a partly created uh, revolved surface which is going to uh, be a component of your uh, uh, soccer ball. So let's say you have done this much and uh, you're going to do the next step that is the offset so select the offset and select the surface here and uh, give an offset of say 10 click preview make sure the offset is uh, towards the inward direction if it's not you can click on this red arrow and you can swap the direction you can click here and you can swap so once that is done, click on OK and then go to the extrude command, insert surface, extrude, select this and do the extrusion. So a little bit to pull the limit downwards so that uh, this particular part uh, is coming out and uh, click on OK and uh, do the same step to do the extrusion for uh, our second sketch here and do the same step here as uh, your your extrusion was coming outwards in the first command it's uh, it's being done automatically on the second one click ok and now you need to do the trim command select this particular extrude you have done and this revolute 3 1 2 and then other side, other side, that's it. Click OK and uh, again you need to do the same step for this. For So here uh, the beginners are going to face a difficulty because they'll be wondering where is the surface. So that's the reason I've uh, shown you, you need to select the Revolute 3. So this one and Revolute 3 and you can click on other side, other side. Click OK and use the same trimming technique for uh, trimming the rest of the surfaces other side so here it's offset so make sure when you're doing it on your particular design you see which one you're supposed to select so click OK click on the trim command once again and uh, click on this particular surface and the offset one, other side, other side, click OK. And uh, you have a portion of uh, your pentagon and hexagon being aligned in front of you. So the next step is to go to insert and uh, operations. You need to do a fillet for this. So you can hide this particular part and start off uh, giving fillet. So you have selected all the faces. Uh, make sure. Okay. As this is in a hexagon, you'll have six faces in one face. So make sure you're having seven elements here. And uh, the radius uh, must be four. So you have your first particular element being created. Hide this and uh, unhide the other part and do the same technique for this that is the uh, edge fillet and here your number of elements should be 6 and uh, click OK and you have your second element being created so you have your portion of uh, a smallest portion of your uh, soccer ball being created here so keep watching uh, for you know uh, knowing more and uh, learning more uh, commands so that you can complete this particular design of soccer ball so I hope you enjoyed my video uh, any doubts any clarifications you have comment just below my video and I'll be getting back to you as soon as possible any suggestions any uh, project help you have you can uh, 
you know you can contact me for uh, help and I'll be helping you out so thank you so much for watching thank you all